Test Drive, 2022 Ford Bronco Raptor delivers Tonka Truck Experience. The year is 2022 and my childhood dreams have come to fruition. Please, someone mark this in my permanent file. A Tonka truck-like vehicle now not only exists for consumers to buy, but it's street legal and can seemingly do almost everything for the, not so low, low, price of $69,995 including destination. Needing no introduction, the 2022 Ford Bronco Raptor or Raptor Raptorizes the Bronco with long travel suspension, massive tires, cartoon-like design, comfortable interior, more power, and ridiculous capability. But its power feels underwhelming, its design won't fit or meet everyone's lifestyle, and it drinks fuel fast. After spending multiple sessions, both living life and doing things no Raptor owner will likely do, here's where this wonderful and absurd creation hits and misses. Hit, cartoon brought to life. As I pulled into my driveway on my road bike and laid eyes, again, on the eruption green Raptor gleaming in the sun, an overwhelming and uncontrolled laughing fit came over me. It's so absurd and hilarious looking. It's like a real-life Tonka truck I played with in my parents' basement as a kid. The bolted-on fender flares are over the top in appearance, but they do serve to widen the stance 8.6 inches over a standard Bronco to cover the Fox Long Travel remote reservoir shock stuffed into the wells. The 37-inch BF Goodrich Co. 02 all-terrain tires look like pillows, there's a planes, trains, and automobiles joke here. The LED daytime running lights are amber rather than white, and there are marker lights, because this thing is over 7 feet wide. It all just comes together in the best way to look crazier than any Wrangler or Defender money can buy from the factory. Miss, terrorizing others, parking lots, and garages. As I blasted on the Highway 169 in the dark with the LED headlights and factory-installed rigid LED fog and driving lights lit, pretty sure the driving lights are meant for off-road use only, whoops, nudged up behind a mid-2000s Honda Civic. The Raptor's bumper was at the height of the Civic's trunk. The Raptor must have looked terrifying in the rearview mirror because I've never seen a Civic change lanes so quickly in my life. The Raptor fit in my standard size garage, built in 1997, next to my wife's 2015 Jeep Grand Cherokee, but a Ford spokesperson was shocked when I told them. The Raptor's too tall for the assembly line, it barely squeaked under my garage door with little room to spare, at nearly 6.5 feet tall. It's nearly the width of an average parking spot, making pulling in and out of spots with cars on either side of the Raptor an exercise in attention to detail. It's not as cumbersome as an F-150 Raptor, but it's a handful. Hit, nothing unsettles it. The Raptor is the true goat. This thing simply keeps its composure no matter what. Potholes? Raptor laughs at them. Speed bumps? More like a ripple in the road. Curbs? Raptors don't care about curbs. With 13.1 inches of ground clearance paired with 13.0 inches of front and 14.0 inches of rear suspension travel, the Raptor's Fox 3.1 internal bias semi-active dampers are magical. Pair all this with 37-inch rubber and it's a recipe for comfort and control. I ripped around the hills surrounding Blue Ridge, Georgia in a way no Raptor owner ever will, shocking even senior editor Robert Duffer. The Raptor didn't care. Not that I would ever jump a set of railroad tracks, because that would be irresponsible, but if a Raptor were to attempt such a thing, it wouldn't flinch. Miss, doesn't rip hard enough. Raptors have a turbocharged 3.0 liter V6 rated at 418 horsepower and 440 lbft of torque mated to a fantastic 10 speed automatic transmission. The transmission might be the powertrain's highlight with the ability to execute incredibly quick and perfect shifts in sport and Baja mode that wouldn't be out of place in a sports car. But at 5,733 pounds the Raptor simply doesn't rip off the line as hard as the lighter 4,754 pounds two-door Wildtrak and its 2.7-liter turbo 6 with 330 horsepower and 415 lbft of torque. The power doesn't match the rest of the Raptor's over-the-topness and is outgunned by the Wrangler 392's 475 horsepower V8 in both fire and fury. 
The bad news is a more powerful Braptor isn't in the works because the team feels the engine's big enough already. They are wrong. Hit, comfortable Recaros. The Braptor comes standard with Recaro bucket seats up front. They are supportive, comfortable, and look great. Sadly, my tester didn't have the optional blue color, but that didn't distract from their comfort. They are far more comfortable than any seat found in a Wrangler, even an $83,400 V8-powered Wrangler. The rear bench seat is basically the same as what's found in other four-door Broncos, which is to say it's fine if not a bit flat. Miss, drinks, a lot. In what will surprise no one, the Braptor loves to drink fuel. It has EPA fuel economy ratings of 15 miles per gallon city, 16 city highway, 15 combined. I'm here to tell you those not-so-great numbers aren't realistic. Over the course of 227 miles of mixed suburban driving the Braptor averaged 13.2 miles per gallon according to the onboard trip computer. This side of the Nissan GTR, and essentially matching the F-150 Raptor with a larger, more powerful twin-turbo V6, the Braptor's V6 gets among the worst fuel economy I've ever experienced in a production six-cylinder in day-to-day -day driving. It might as well have a V8, as that similar fuel economy as the Jeep Wrangler 392. 2022 Ford Bronco Raptor At $69,995, but $75,770 is tested thanks to graphics, optional wheels, leather trim suede seats, and a keyless entry pad, the Raptor borders on seeming fairly priced for its capabilities out of the box. That is if you actually find one for the sticker price during these wild times. The Braptor is not in a class of one, but it's in rarefied air and feels like the most complete and best package. It's easily one of the most outrageous and my new favorite most ridiculous thing money can buy. Base price, $69,995, including destination. Price is tested, $75,770. Powertrain, 418 horsepower twin turbo 3.0 liter V6, 10 speed automatic, 4 wheel drive. EPA fuel economy, 15 16 15 mpg. The hits, cartoon like design, fantastic transmission programming, unflappable ride, comfortable seats. Thanks for watching. Drop a like. Leave a comment. And don't forget to subscribe to watch more videos like this.